Oh my gosh, I almost dropped it. Hi guys, welcome to a new vlog. Today's video is going to be... <clears throat> My throat is going to be pretty much a chill day. I'm gonna kind of treat myself to a spa day, at least like take a bath because I have all of this like self-care stuff that my boss actually gave me for Christmas and I really wanna use it. Um, today's a really rainy day here. I know it looks bright, but it's actually kind of gloomy out. So we're just gonna take the day easy. Um, I am being somewhat productive because I'm filming. It is actually one o'clock, so I did have the morning to myself. So I'm just going to probably eat lunch. I just got done editing a little video for my boss and her friend so it's just like a little simple video that they wanted to have for a Facebook page that they run so I did that this morning I also was looking on a company's a clothing company's website because I think I'm going to be working with this company and I'm really excited because I don't know just as a you know micro influencer as they say getting to work with brands is always super fun and I'm so excited I just wanted to thank you guys because I feel like I don't say that enough. I feel like a lot of influencers don't say that enough and it really does need to be said. So thank you for watching my videos, being interested in my little life. I know the topic's gonna change really fast, but I'm just waiting for this video to like finish exporting and then um, I'm going to have lunch and I'm just gonna have my regular lunch, I think. Um, I still have a Fit Life Foods meal that I need to eat, but I'll probably have that for dinner tonight. of the lunch. I actually have a little shake after I have the stuff. I just don't want it to get warm, but I kind of replaced my like cookies with just the protein shake. So it's a little healthier, but I tried. <laughs> So what inspired me to make this video is this gift from my boss from work. She got me this cute little like spa day, I don't know, bath essentials. So I'm gonna open it on up. We're gonna dive on into it and then I'm gonna get into a nice bath. And I just deep cleaned my bathtub because I just feel like every time you take a bath, you need to scrub everything down, obviously. Got done doing that and we'll just break this on open. Ooh, my gosh, I almost dropped it. Okay, so first I think we have this bath bomb and this is what actually inspired me to make this video is because this thing looks like it's supposed to be used in the bathtub. <laughs> Hopefully I'm right about that. Next up we have these fuzzy socks and I think they're so cute. I wear fuzzy socks a lot. I wore them a lot more when I didn't have my new slippers, but I still wear a lot of fuzzy socks and these are so cute. They actually remind me of the Ronald McDonald socks <laughs> and they were kind of for Christmas, but with Valentine's Day coming up, up. I feel like they still go with the theme of the year. Also, I have this sock that doesn't have a pair, so I just like put it up there. Next, we have this shower gel, and this is all vanilla flavored. Mmm. If you know what Lip Smackers is, I don't know, I feel like a lot of my viewers would know that, but it smells like a Lip Smackers, like lip gloss, like the vanilla. That brings me back. I'm definitely gonna use this, that's fun. Then we have bath salts. Oh my gosh, I've never used bath salts. I've only used like the bath bombs, so I'm definitely gonna have to read like the instructions. Oh my gosh, this is cool. It probably smells the same since everything is vanilla flavored. They just look like this, that's cute. Aw, okay, so I'm gonna put that out there, like keep that out there. Then we have this body butter. Let's give this a sniff. Mmm, it smells just like it. I love that. Brings me back to like when I wore like lip gloss all the time. I loved lip smackers. I don't know, it just gives that nostalgic feel. Then we have this. I wonder what this is. Is this like a loofah or like a scrubby thing? I don't know. <laughs> Hopefully maybe it'll tell us. I don't know, but 
We have this little scrub thing. Maybe you're supposed to put it on your arm and like exfoliate. That's my only guess with this. Oh, and we get a bubble bath. That is so good because I really wanted to make my little um, bath bubbly today because I haven't had a bubble bath in so long. Oh my gosh. I mean, you can see I never like treat myself or like do any of this stuff. Most people would probably do like a face mask, but I don't have any. I got rid of the one that I collabed with because it was like super old. And that is everything that is in this bin. We just have some styrofoam and plastic in this cute little bin. I think my mom would definitely want to use this or something. That's really convenient. Also, I'm going to burn this chill candle. I was going to burn my like fall candle because that's really the only candle I have that I like the scent. Well, also I have this one. I have this one from Urban Outfitters. It's kind of losing its smell and it's like kind of turning green on the inside, but I mostly just use this for room decor. So it just sits over there, but I'm gonna burn this chill candle. I think my mom got this for a gift. We don't really know where this came from, but its flavor is vanilla as well. It's a little bit of a different smell than this vanilla, but it's still got that vibe and we're gonna burn this. So I guess uh, let's just head on into the bathroom. I'm gonna start the bubble bath and yeah. Okay, so I finally got this candle lit. I was trying to film myself lighting the candle, but it really didn't work. So yeah, the candle is burning. Um, I have all my little bath stuff here. I don't know what I'm gonna try. I'll probably try the bath salts because I just don't know a lot about them. And then we have bubble bath and the little bath bomb. So I guess I'll just turn this on. Maybe I should take my little loofahs off. Yes, I have two because one's for my face. I, I don't wanna wash my face with like the one I use for my body. <laughs> Oh shoot. Okay, well that was dumb. I'm so used to showering that I pulled this up. Oh my gosh. There we go. Okay, so I'm already in the bathtub. Scrub it up, dub. I'm gonna drop this bath bomb inside the water. I just use the entire thing because it is kind of small. I know some people can save them or some people do save them, but I'm just gonna use the entire thing. <laughs> Okay, so I'm gonna pour some bath salts in now. I kind of drained some of the water, so the whole thing wasn't just a bath bomb. So I drained a little bit of it so we can try this out. I'm just gonna pour some in. I don't know how, like, how much you're supposed to use. It literally just looks like salt. I don't know if you can see very well, but there it goes. Okay, I think that's enough. I still have a lot left to use, so I'll probably just put that in a Ziploc baggie. I guess this is supposed to just like be absorbed by the water. We shall find out. I'm gonna put some bubbles in pretty soon. Oh yeah, they're already starting to disintegrate when I'm like moving them around and stuff. Okay, so I just put the bubbles in and obviously I know how to work a bubble bath. So um, yeah, I got the bubbles and the water. Smells really good, it smells like vanilla. I haven't had a bubble bath in so long, guys. It's been forever. Also, my candle over here is doing well. Okay, so I don't know why I watched a video on a candle, but a very healthy thing for your candles is letting the wax burn all the way to the edge on the first burn or else you'll get like tunneling, which sounds weird, but yeah, I don't know. So I'm definitely gonna let the candle like go all the way out to the edges, like get the wax all out there um, so it doesn't like break the candle. Just gonna sit here, relax. Also, I wanted to mention that I don't know when the last time I've done this I think it was probably like three years ago or like a year ago. My mom and I were just like talking about it cause she was like, when are you gonna get me a bath day or something like that? Like, I don't know, get all this stuff for her. I'm like, oh, I don't know. So it was really funny. Hi, welcome to Floating Head Alex. See my little candle there. I'm trying to make it like a little bit less weird, but to add to this video, my hair's looking crazy. Um, but to add to this video, I wanted to share this like little story time thing because I think it's so funny. Um, I get a lot of like weird DMs and I wanted to share them with you guys. I actually screenshotted this a while ago. Um, hold on, my friend just texted me. Back to what I was talking about. Okay, so I saved these screenshots. I think I only have one. I'll put the screenshot up now. This girl's also from Florida. And if I'm free Saturday, would you like to hang out with me? When I am free this Saturday, I would love to hang out. We can go to the park or Disney or even 
in, watch a movie or something. They already said, I can't wait to hang out with you on Saturday. Guys, when you're messaging YouTubers or influencers or anyone you don't really know in real life, like that's just not the way to make friends. You kind of have to make it naturally, like comment on photos, engage with what they're doing. I don't know. I met one of my really good friends from YouTube and it just naturally grew to a friendship. It wasn't like want to be YouTube friends or want to hang out on Saturday. I said, maybe I've been pretty busy with work and everything. Thank you so much for watching my videos. I always try to respond to like anyone that messages me because it's really nice, but I don't know. It's just one of those things where I don't know. I try to just be nice about it and then they go, OMG, where do you work? Maybe I can come by and get a selfie together, but you seriously need to take a break and go to Epcot with me. My favorite park is Epcot. My favorite part of Epcot is Australia because I'm Australian and it brings back so much childhood memories. Ha ha. I think Pluto is a very interesting planet. Like I don't know what is going on, but this person is like pretty bizarre. I'm not trying to be rude, but like number one, there's no Australia in Epcot and no, you can't. Even the place where I work, which I can't even get in because of like coronavirus and stuff is like all secured and everything. Like you have to have this like ID badge or like security let you in. So like, no. And that's just really inappropriate. So I don't know. I just wanted to share this message with you guys. Cause like I get some crazy messages and then I just responded to that and said, sorry, I don't feel comfortable with that. And I think I blocked them, but that's just like kind of the scale of like some of my messages. And it's kind of creepy as heck, not going to lie. So yeah, I just wanted to kind of read that to you guys because I've been wanting to share that for so long. It's been like in my photos for a while just because I wanted to share it. So that was so relaxing. I just sat and listened to some podcasts and just chilled out for, I don't know, probably more than a couple hours just sitting in there bathing. I feel like it's really good for my muscles and I probably should do that more often, but I'm going to try the body butter now. I kind of want to use everything in the box. Like that was my goal for this video because I really wanted to try it and just like force myself to like have a relaxing spa day. Also my head is like super shiny. I hate it when it does that. This is my leg obviously <laughs> and I'm just going to see how this works. Mmm smells really good. This is a body butter so I'm assuming that you just obviously put it on your body. Obviously I don't know why I just said that. Okay it's very thick. I like it. Buttery I guess. A plus. This is nice. Okay, so a little candle checkup. Um, it's not fully burned to the outside, so I'm gonna keep it on a little bit longer. Obviously, I'm gonna take it into the room where I am so I can supervise the thing. I still have some bubble bath. I saved that for Valerie because she made the comment about she never takes baths either. <laughs> and I also saved some bath salts. This is a good exfoliator. I think that's what it is because it's a little rough. I use that, so hopefully that's the correct way to use it. She just got home from work. I did, I just got home I from work. I thought I would film some more of the mothers. Valor's over there working. Stuff for the big party, Mark. <laughs> okay, Oh, yay. she's choking over there. Why did I forgot about it being tomorrow, and people were talking about it. We are like, what are you doing for the Super Bowl? I'm like, um, I worked until six. We're like, oh, it's not on like, until like 6.30 or something. I'm like, okay. So I thought, well, spinach dip is always a good thing, and you know, hot dogs. We got all the stuff over there ready for our little party. Yay. Oh, we have more cookies. Yeah. For tonight? Yeah. Okay. I hope you guys enjoyed this little fun video. I've never really done this before. Like a full on spa day, just relax, take it easy while also a film. So if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you guys in my next video.